Welcome back to another Rose City Reptiles video. I'm Joey. This is Rose City Reptiles and today's video is many years in the making. Um, tons of blood, sweat, and tears for this moment right now. This is incredible. That beautiful pure blue albino tegu that we have has been bred to topaz and she is currently laying eggs right behind me. I haven't seen the eggs. I just peeked in on her just a few minutes ago and I saw her kind of moving her body pushing an egg out and yeah she's I have an albino tegu in my backyard right now laying eggs like that is incredible to me I already I called my brother and my sister and I was like this is what's happening y'all good vibes send them my way send good vibes my way and and the reason is for that I mean I've always wanted to produce albino tegus like that has been a goal of mine for years now for probably five years or so, I've wanted to produce albino tegus, and I haven't had m good luck when it comes to producing albinos. I feel it, I know this is my year. This is my year, things are going so well as far as breeding tegus go, and I just know this is my year. And when I saw her pushing out an egg, I mean, it's just, it's just such a relief and just, I don't know. It's a great feeling what's happening here right now. So I wanted to just like pull out the camera. My brother was like, get that camera, get the raw emotion right now on camera. So that's what I'm doing. I mean, this, I, I, I'm not good at expressing myself on camera, but I really am just, I don't know, at a loss for words. Like this is a big deal to me. I, I, I want to produce my own albinos and I cannot wait to hatch out an albino tell you like that is I'm gonna cry I think I'm gonna cry when I, I may cry when I pull these eggs out of here because it really has been that much work you know and it's working with reptiles it's I mean it, it, it's a labor of love it has to be a passion otherwise if you're in this for the money you're not gonna make it you just won't make it I would have been weeded out years ago um, because it it just doesn't work that way <laughs> and you got to just love what you're doing and yeah and I certainly do love today today is a special special day so I'm gonna open up the enclosure I have her in one of the small enclosures sometimes the nesting females when I I just observe them I watch them and if they seem like they want something a little bit smaller with the sides not open you know if they're if they're if I see them like just pacing and surfing the cage, then I move them over here. That's why I have this. I may build another one because it really works well. Um, they're still large, but they're only two feet wide and like, I think like nine feet long or so. But this is what I have her in. I have a hide in there with a hinge top. So I'm gonna open it up and look inside the hide and kind of get an idea of where she's at. Cause I don't know when she started laying. I don't know if she's almost done or just starting. By the time, I'm sweating, it is so hot in Texas now. But from the time of the day, let me see what time it is for documentation. It's 7.41, look, it's still bright out here. It's not getting dark until like almost nine o'clock. But um, 7.41, so yeah, I'm guessing she's probably been going for about an hour. I would guess about 6.30 once this, it starts cooling down a bit. So yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna look in there and kind of see What's going on? I'll bring you with me. I'm gonna bring you guys with me, don't panic. So let's go, let's look inside and let's see what she's doing. If, it, if I sense at all that we're disturbing her, if she's looking at me, sometimes they're in like a trance and they don't really pay attention to you. But if she's looking at me and I'm disturbing her, I'm just gonna stop. We're gonna stop the videoing and we'll catch back up like in a couple hours or so. And we'll collect these eggs. Like we are collecting albino tegu eggs tonight this is happening this is actually like am i dreaming right now this is real this is huge thank you everyone seriously this is incredible let's get in there okay so i've got it opened up you guys can see that the lid opens lays all the way back i have her top opened up right there and let's come in here and take a look at her
So as you guys can see, she's kind of just chilling, laying there, laying her eggs. Um, I said chilling, like she's not doing anything. She's doing <laughs> a tremendous job. She's working hard, laying these eggs. Um, I'm gonna set up the camera. She doesn't seem to be paying any attention to us at all. So I'm gonna set up the camera kind of over her and see if we can get some footage of her pushing out some of the eggs. And then, yeah, and I'm, I'm just gonna be camping out here for tonight. Like I'm chilling out here with her. Um, I wanna be right there if there's a problem. I wanna be there as soon as she's done. Um, I just wanna make sure things go smoothly. Uh, so yeah, so I'm gonna get some, <laughs> couple drinks I'm gonna pull a chair up and I'm chilling right here this is a good night I ain't complaining so she's pushing an egg out right now So hopefully you guys saw that, you know, just kind of wiggling their body, um, you know, kind of like Shakira and pushing that egg out. So, I mean, she just laid an egg. That's someone's future pet, beautiful blue, possibly albino tegu. I'm whispering, hopefully you guys can hear me well, but yeah, all right. I'm gonna set up the tripod right here. I'm gonna set that up and I'm just gonna be chilling and let's, let's see how tonight goes.
Okay, just a quick update. I don't know how the lighting is working right now. Hopefully you guys can see me. Um, it is neighbor shooting guns in the country. That's okay. But um, yeah, it's, it's uh, about 9.30 now. She's still in there on her nest. She has not come off of it. I haven't, I've, I'm still, I got my chair right there. I'm still chilling, just enjoying the evening. Um, yeah, it's nice, relaxing, quiet evening. And yeah, we're just, I'm just keeping an eye on her, making sure things go smoothly. And yeah, so I don't know, I expect maybe it's been a, at least a couple hours now. So I think she'll finish up here in the next hour, 30 minutes, we'll see. But um, next time I see you guys, I guess I'll show you the nest whenever I collect the eggs and then we'll be inside the reptile building putting the eggs away. So see you guys soon. Okay, so it's, it's, uh, dark out here I'm not, I think it's about 10 o'clock so not much later after the update I checked on her and she was turning around and so I put her in a box and there's the nest so I obviously need both hands to film so I got to put the camera away and I will see you guys um, inside the reptile building with how many eggs did we get all right see you guys soon all right, so I I grabbed the eggs and brought them inside and couldn't grab the camera and I went ahead and set them up. I know how many eggs that albino blue female laid. I know how many. Um, and before I tell you, thank you guys like so much for all the support this past year um, since we've been on YouTube. The channel's grown so much and it's been a lot of fun and I really don't think that my business or my hobby, whatever you want to call it, would be here if it wasn't for youtube so i appreciate it um it's been a lot of fun thank you guys for watching like this video if you haven't now let me show you what i was blessed with tonight all right so what we were blessed with is what you're looking at right here in total 38 eggs um i do believe the three i have down here on the end that are by themselves that those are not good eggs um and so that brings us to 30 five eggs i don't know if i've ever seen a blue tegu lay 35 eggs that is way up there um, i'm so proud of her and i'm beyond excited to see these eggs hatch out i cannot wait to produce the first rose city reptiles albinos 2020 so these are going to be our first blues they're high white blues these are going to be the first clutch and the first albinos that hatch out for us this year i'm so excited thank you guys so much for watching today's video this is a day i will never forget it is the day that i collected my first albino tegu eggs it's it's a special day worked hard for this and again thank you for the support all right guys if you're excited to see these albinos hatch out like this video subscribe and i'll see you guys next time bye